and a huge crowd of trick-or-treaters has arrived here as well. I, I got to tell you about this place. Nearly every square inch of Rick Tatelman's driveway, his yard, his garage, it's all covered with uh, things that are designed to delight and frighten both kids and adults, and he is doing a great job of it today. There are witches telling stories. Plenty of scary clowns laughing at it all, and a host of their scary Halloween friends. Rick Tatelman spends a couple of months putting it all together in his yard every year for the last three plus decades. Why? Because it's fun. When I have the Halloween display on at night and people come to visit, the adults like it just as much as the kids. <laughs> and every year, Tatelman adds a few more features. He estimates about 200 features in his yard this year, including plenty of pumpkins. Oh, and he's got a few skeletons in and out of his closet. It takes up his entire yard and garage, and he started to use a little space belonging to his understanding neighbors. Next door neighbors Bill and Trisha Ballad have had to buy more candy to accommodate the huge crowds that show up on the block every year. Last year, they went through about 30 pounds. In the past, we'd get, you know, mm -hmm. maybe 40, 50 kids a night before we lived next to Rick, so it's <laughs> significantly more kids. He tends to draw a few here, huh? A little bit, yeah. yeah. Tatelman says he's lost track of how much he spends on this display, but it's a lot. He does it all at his own expense, though he does have a collection bowl to raise money for charity. Of course, aside from the spooky characters, Halloween is also about the trick-or-treating, and Tatelman has that covered pretty well also. He's got an assortment of full-size candy bars to hand out to the older kids and smaller selections for the younger ones, as well as gift cards for free ice cream at Culver's. For Tatelman, Halloween is the best day of the year. Halloween is just a fun holiday. And it's even more fun this year for Tatelman. This is an extra special Halloween. He became a grandfather for the very first time about 20 minutes before midnight last night. So happy Halloween indeed. Watch breaking news on YouTube. Subscribe to ABC7 Chicago Eyewitness News.